Let's sing a song full of hope, full of pain. Why don't you sing along, my friend? For it's our last refrain. Forever young, ever strong, ever brave. Memories like this never end. No, they don't fade away. So when I'm Good morning everyone and welcome back to another vlog. So, me and Carrie, Carrie over here if you haven't watched the last vlog, um, Carrie stayed around last night because we are driving to Cambridge to meet the girls and by girls I mean Chloe, Jess and Abby. I'll leave everyone's like details down below so you can go check them out after this vid. We are going to be missing Alexa though which is so sad because she's just got back from Croatia and is having to quarantine which obviously we didn't think was going to be a thing. Um, but yeah, we're going to Cambridge. The weather's not looking great. Like, it's looking very dull. I mean, the, the blue skies have come out a bit. Half half and half. But it's literally been pissing it down all of yesterday and this morning. So hopefully we have a little bit of sunshine or even just some, like, dry patches so we can actually do some stuff. Um, because we had a few things planned. Like, we were going to be going punting today, but we don't know if that's going to be an actual write-off because of the weather. So we'll see. But yeah, we're literally leaving in the next five ten minutes i'd say <laughs> exciting so we've got a little road trip i think it's about like an hour in the car and um, maybe a little bit less and then we'll be with everyone <laughs> and it's actually our first time of meeting them in real in the flesh i feel like we've known them for ages though because of um instagram so yeah and we're staying in an ibis so we're literally going away for one night and look at all this stuff in the back <laughs> Carrie, what like what is wrong with us? Like we have got like five tote bags, two suitcases, A Zara, order. <laughs> Zara order. I've got my ring light and tripod yeah. and coats. I did put it in, I think. I'm just gonna double check that one because that would be a nightmare. Yeah, I've got it. Right, okay, let's go. Wee. So we are in Cambridge and with the girls. They're all behind. We've literally just done some photos and we just like to head to the hotel. So everyone say hello to the vlog. Hi, hi, Introduce hi. yourself. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm very bad. laughs> hello, my name is Jess. Hi, I'm Abby. I'm Chloe. Okay. <laughs> right, we're just about to go to check in at the hotel and then we're gonna go shopping, I think. Yeah. Zara. 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 And, the, and the sun's come out. Zara. Fingers Good crossed it's not Zara. going to rain when we go hunting. Come on, manifest it, manifest it. We have just checked into the hotel. We're staying at an Ibis. The last time we were in an Ibis, we were uh, in London um, for a Halloween event, which was really fun with, was it Teen Teenage Cancer Trust and Ibis. Ibis were like combined for like a cool Halloween event. It was so fun. Um, but this is what our room looks like. We've got a little full length mirror here, which is obviously handy. We've got a big, like the bed's quite big, like I'd yeah. say, like quite a nice size bed. We've already thrown everything on it as always. Um, TV, we've got like a little cubby here for wardrobe space, you know, some extra pillows up there mugs and stuff some info on how they're regulating um the hotel with covid restrictions and then in the bath i felt like i was in a rocket ship inside the toilet i don't know if anyone else gets the same vibe it's in like a weird like sort of capsule and like it do you know what i mean the door's like quite weird anyway this is what it's looking like it's quite nice actually like very bright in here to do makeup quite nice um, and then we've got a lovely big shower. We so I've just had a little outfit change. Um, my shirt that I was in had tan all in because I was sweating driving. Love that for me. And um, the weather's started raining again. We had like a little nice spot whilst we quickly took some photos outside. But yeah, I've gone for this outfit because I thought it was kind of weather appropriate. It's like semi waterproof, not really, because it's faux leather, but I don't know, it just gives me warm vibes. <laughs> um, but it's from Nasty Gal. I got it last year or like earlier on this year and I absolutely love it. Like it's one of my fave, like, sort of transition pieces from and then I'm pairing it with my mom jeans from Primark which I really love I would like them if they're a little bit tighter but I also want to be comfortable while we're shopping and then we've got a gold necklace from Millie Grace jewelry that I love and um, Primark earrings and my lashes are from Sean who lives in my local area if anyone's from Wellingborough Northamptonshire um, definitely go check her out because like it's made putting makeup on so much easier. Yeah, and then I'm putting on my new shoes from Emma Customs, which are down here. And they are literally stunning. They're like the light of my life. They literally look amazing. If you're looking for custom shoes, 
um, then defo go check out Emma Customs. Sort of basic because I'm basic, but I just kind of like the pop of colour. I think they're pretty cool. And Carrie rubbed off the shit that I had on them with a the leaf because she is best friend goals. Oh my god, look at this bag that Carrie has from Zara. How stunning is that? Oh, it's heavenly. Fully it's obsessed. Gold, yeah. Heavy, gold I really, I keep seeing like those she... chains and I just want to, so I just grip. I just feel like I want to grip them, you know? Is it, the only thing I will say is it's cold. Chains. It's cold. That's yeah. quite nice, I think. Not for somebody who's always cold. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm always hot, so it's quite nice for me. What, the Cambridge chat's going off. I think our next stop is the shops. I really want to go to Zara. Maybe have a look in Primark if there's one close by. To, I don't know. But yeah, it'll be nice to have a little bit of a shop. And then hopefully, if the weather holds out, it's really chucking it down right now. But hopefully around four it stops because we really want to go punting. We've had, got it all booked, so don't really know what happens if not. So we're currently in Zara. We've just picked up this gorgeous like black basics for like autumn winter. I love it. Um, Carrie's having a little mince around. Have you got anything at the minute? No. She's having a little I wish around. This was a lighter blue, you know? Yeah, that'd be cool. Why does my nose keep on it? What, like, I don't know. Woohoo! Just had a little bit of shopping. Um, got a Zara bag. Only got like a little basic thing I'll show you later. Danger! I'm just busking. Abby's getting a little pick over there. And um, by the cute little pink telephone boxes, they're everywhere. Want, I mean everywhere there's two <laughs> there's two and there's, but this is so cute um what else we've got Zara bags we've got no one bought anything from H&M right and we just got some toothpaste and a mascara from Boots now we're off punting Hunting. Uh, it was actually oh beautiful. Um, right, if you're ever in Cambridge, go to Rutherford's punting. It was absolutely Love amazing. It. Say the crazy um, girl sent you. <laughs> crazy girl. Hell no, who you mean. Yeah. Thank you to Rutherford for letting us um, come on one of your boats. And we had like such an amazing time. I've never um, done anything like that before, so it was a really cool experience. So we really appreciate it. Um, look, everyone's vlogging. I'm pissing. <laughs> Um, it was absolutely amazing and our show was incredible so if you're ever in Cambridge area and you're looking for the perfect place if you want to go for punting then definitely check out Rutherford's and ask. I think now we are maybe heading back. We Are we heading back now? And then we're heading back to the hotel room aren't we? We're gonna freshen ourselves up and then head out for dinner afterwards. That's what we're doing and Levin? Levin. Levin told us some beautiful places. We've got a Romy, the lamb, this mimosa plate, lamb mimosa behind us. Um, so we're gonna have a little look, figure out what we want all together. Something nice and local as yeah. well. Yeah, I've just been getting ready because we're going out for food and drinks. I think we're gonna try and go to an Italian restaurant, I think. And then we're gonna go out for drinks, maybe at Varsity, because that was what a lot of people recommended. Um, because it has like a rooftop. Revs looked quite nice for rooftop vibes. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna have a little look, but I'm wearing my new little purchase from Zara. I absolutely love it. It's sort of like you can just make it casual or more dressed up, but um it's just like a little black ribbed long sleeve top it has a scoop neck which i really like i find it quite flattering and then i'm wearing my missy empire split jeans with some primark mules and um, they're like strappy they're really oh, cute. cute this is the look and then i'm wearing this my trusty primark bag that i love we all got absolutely drenched because um it's kind of like pelting it down with the rain um but we finally decided to come to frank and Manga because the only place it was open and um, we're all literally starving, so we've got a margarita, garlic bread. We've pretty much all got the same thing, we're just random toppings. Oh, yummy! <laughs> so we are now back at the hotel. It is what? Like half nine? Half nine, quarter to ten. Um, and we tried to go to Revs after Franco Manca. The pizza was amazing. I literally physically couldn't finish it though because there was so much bread. 
it was literally so delicious and then obviously it's been pissing down with rain we got a taxi to revs waited in the queue for about 15 minutes and it didn't move so we're now back in the ibis we went to sainsbury's <laughs> we've all got loads of snacks like abby and um, jess and chloe have loads of snacks as well so we've got like caramel nibbles squashies chocolate cornflakes um and then we've got bottles of wine we're making the best out of a bad situation essentially <laughs> right let's go good morning everyone so we sort of like crashed last night after about three hours in jess and chloe's room we were just having a sort of chat and then this morning me and carrie woke up early and had to prepare some stuff for the consistency launch which is tomorrow and um, very stressful but we thought we really needed some sleep last night so we decided to wake up this morning to do that and um, and um, we're gonna go downstairs grab a cafe nero and shoot some outfits for checking out and stuff <laughs> yeah i think we're going to bills for brunch in the center so, so that's all the plans that i've got for the day i'm wearing this um pink suit from nasty gal which i love so we're at bills for brunch i had a matcha coconut latte which was amazing and then an apple juice and i've got some little fried potatoes pancakes carrie's got this gorgeous breakfast over here what was yours called bill's garden bill's garden breakfast just stunning food over there chloe's abby's <laughs> So we have all just grabbed some ice cream from Jack's Gelato and um, it was recommended quite a lot and I've got the mint chopped chip and the girls there with all their cones behind. So we've been doing consistency for the last few hours because we've got our launch tomorrow which I feel like I've said about 20 million times <laughs> um, but it is like a very different one it's actually a service rather than a product which is why it's taking obviously a lot longer than usual we're getting used to like a new sort of thing on the website do you know what i mean mm -hmm. it's a new thing on the website a new product to create and stuff like there's a lot of stuff that's obviously been a lot different from the previous ones um, and although it's still digital it has just it's been not like a one-off thing like this as well where it's just done doing mean, it's a service so. yeah so it's gonna be sort of like a three month period but yeah by the time this goes up it will have launched which is scary mm -hmm. um very mm -hmm. nervous very excited um to see the response and everything people are guessing on our stories at the minute and it's mm, just, just put a little thing up saying like that's what we're about to launch yeah it's exciting and like sort of encouraging seeing that everyone's getting involved mm. and like i don't know Ooh, but we've still got a lot to do like we said the promo is what takes probably a lot of the time yeah we're literally going to head back now abby chloe and jess left a couple of hours ago because they had like trains to catch and to get back so we just thought we'd stay for a little bit because it's easier together anyway, yeah it's it? easy to sort out the business together we've said that before in other vlogs mm -hmm. like when we're in birmingham it's so much easier for us to like have conversations in real <laughs> life like so long. Really? it's so much easier for my head. It's like really <laughs> but we're really struggling <laughs> it is it's though because so our yeah. fucking wi-fi is so bad mm. like between us like it just constantly cuts off like we can't hear each other but when we're like physically sat like showing each other it's stuff so hard, like, exchanging ideas yeah my favorite ever Lovely. that's what happens in all my vlogs <laughs> yeah, literally we're just about to leave cambridge drop carry halfway home and then head back so I am now back from Cambridge. I had the loveliest time ever with the girls. I honestly, I cannot wait for us to organize something again because it was so fun and just nice to like spend some time with some girls that obviously we, I'd spoken to a lot online, but I never met in person. And it's so weird because I feel like I know them all so well, which we were like talking about last night and how it's so, just so crazy how we've like all met, met just like through Instagram and stuff. And so it was absolutely amazing. I'll leave all the girls handles down below. They're all so lovely, kind, amazing girls. And I really just hope we can do it again soon. And with alexa we miss alexa so much we're so sad that she had to quarantine but yeah so i came home to some really cool pr so i had got an amazing parcel from benefit they've just brought out a new brow product and benefit always bring out the sickest brow products ever like i absolutely love gimme brown browsings and they sent over a parcel with this really cute little benefit um band um loads of temporary tattoos which i thought was quite a cool idea because the new um 24 hour brow product is like 
uh, microblading sort of dupe, <laughs> if that makes sense. So this is what it looks like. It's called the Brow Microfilling Pen. Um, the packaging is just incredible, just lots of like tattoo style vibes. And they've gone for, they've sent me light brown and medium brown. I think medium brown will be more my shade, so I will let you guys know what it looks like on but it's supposed to be like waterproof smudge proof last 24 hours so it has that sort of micro pigmentation effect um i'm just very excited to try this out and hopefully i will maybe in a future vlog estrid have come through and sent me up a little top up they've sent me a like stone colored razor the wall the wall holder and um, the little travel sort of pouch and then some extra blades which is amazing these rays are insane i worked with them on instagram and i literally haven't looked back since i always used to have to get like men's razors to actually be able to hack away at my legs and remove the hair but th these are genuinely the best razors ever i've got this lamp from a brand called bird i think bird is spelt with two eyes and they have sent over this really cool contraption yeah i got it in the bubblegum pink color i think it comes in blue and yellow i want to say or mint and yellow but i went for the pink and this is what it looks like it's actually a night lamp but also I think you plug it in but it's also a sex toy so it like doubles as both which i think is so cool i actually need a light night lamp for my room so it's going to be quite cool and the vibrations when i tried it earlier are very intense so we'll see how that goes and then i feel like i'm getting lots of sex toy pr stuff recently so sorry about that but love that for me so i just thought i'd show you those little bits but yeah thank you very much for watching this cambridge vlog i hope you enjoyed it i really would love to go to cambridge again because i feel like we didn't get the full full experience because i feel like we missed out on the like evening places because of how hilariously soaked we got so yeah maybe when it's like a sunnier day a sunnier evening we'll be able to go out for some drinks there was a lot of like rooftop bars and stuff that we missed out on which is sad but hopefully we'll be able to go again soon make sure to hit the thumbs up if you did enjoy it subscribe down below if you're new and i will see you very soon for a brand new vlog